What's up guys, today we have another Rexon mod menu showcase and I have the developer right here He made a new version um, yes. a few days ago or today, I'm not, I'm not really sure But yeah, we're gonna yeah. be showcasing it and if you want to get this menu The link to his discord and my discord with the menus on is in the description So if you want it, go there and if you don't know how to get it There's a video right here, right here, shows you how to get it So watch that and let's get straight into the video guys Person. Okay, so first we got switch menu hands, which means you just switch uh, the hands. Wait, it's gonna be like in your other hand. I'm gonna turn that off because it breaks my camera, kind of. Bro. Mm -hmm. Okay, then we have left trigger disconnect. You click your left left trigger and you disconnect. You have join random. It joins a random public. Then we have platforms. It's good old platforms. You use your grips for this, and it's yeah, can see it. nice color. And yeah. You can see other people with the Rexon menu, they use it, they can see it, which is pretty cool. We have Mosa speed boost, it's a slight speed boost. Now this is a really good, this is actually really good because I use it and no one like sees that I'm actually using it. We have Invis Monkey, yeah. it's your right secondary, which is B. You click, uh, wait, is it B? Yeah, it's B. So you click B and you go invisible. Then you have Ghost Monkey, which is uh, I think it's Y, you click Y, and Ghost Monkey. We have No Clip Monkey, you use left trigger with this. All the trees disappear here when you do that. And the bucket, bucket over there as well. Make sure to use platform, so you're gonna wanna use it like this. And then if you wanna get up, you just do that. I turned off. Okay. Then we have Fly Monkey, you fly you fly with your right secondary, which is B. Wherever you look, wherever your head goes, you, you go. Um, it's very fast, so be careful with that, I guess. Kill all, mm -hmm. we're here in the paint roll lobby just because of it, but we're both orange, pretty weird, but I'm just gonna use it. It kills everyone. You don't even need to take this thing out, which I thought you had to do last time, but you don't. It just breaks mm -hmm. their balloons, just like that. We have server-sided tracers, it gives everyone in the server tracers. Yeah. We have and normal if tracers. Infected, it'll be like a very bright red that everyone can easily see. It's like green yeah. one, it's harder to see. Yeah, so basically with tracers, if you use tracers, it's green. Those are the people that aren't tagged and red are the people that are tagged. We yeah, have steam long arms. You. you use left trigger to make your, your arm shorter and you use right trigger to make your arms longer. And you can turn it off like that. Tag assist nearest player. Basically, tag assist, I, if, I, if I'm... If you hold know, your right trigger, you get like a boost to me. Yeah, you see, you see, I'm like see, flying. See, and then you can use it him. at the same time as running, so it makes you like really fast. Yeah, it makes you really fast, easier it to makes tag it the easy guy. To tag me. It works on everything, basically. That was kind of goofy. Then we have tag self. It tags you. So basically, what you do, you click right trigger, and your rig goes to him, goes on his hand, and that's how you get tagged. You have point gun, which means you point, you click right trigger and then you go invisible, but your rig follows them. Silent hand taps, your hand taps are silent and they do work. You have loud hand taps and you, your land taps are extremely loud. You have rapid hand taps, which means you don't even have to move your hands. They keep tapping and they also kind of make you faster. You have yeah. tag all, it tags everyone in the lobby, but um, he's gonna do it real quick. Oh, you can do it, it's fine. So it's a right trigger to do it. Yeah guys, right trigger. And you go on top of them and your hand tag the, tags them. We have tag gun, it's just the same gun and it tags them. I can use it on you. Yeah, did you guys see it flies on top of me and I'm gonna do it on him. You go right on top of him. There are vibrate other, others, you need master. You guys won't be able to see, yeah, feel control, this obviously, but it just vibrates vibrate. my controllers. Vibrate gun, you use it specifically on someone. Uh, you have slow yeah. others. It slows them, but it might not be working. I don't think it's working. I still haven't fixed it because it's not like my top priority. Yeah. We have set master. Do not, do not use this in publics because you will get banned. It only yeah, works only, in modded not lobbies. Even privates, only modded. Yeah, only modded lobbies because you can't really get reported in modded lobbies. You have projectile speed. It changes your projectile speed. I did show this in my last video, so if you guys want to see it, it'll be. Uh, here or here, I don't know. I think it's here. No, we could show it now quickly. Oh, he show also added a very fast. Speed. He did add a very fast 
so you can barely even see yeah, them. Yeah, it looks like the balloons just teleport there. Yeah, so we have very fast, we have slow, we have default, which is just the normal speed, and we have fast. Very fast, it just looks like it teleports there, so you can't really see what you're doing. Uh, I'll keep it on default, I like that. So that was balloon okay. minigun. There's slingshot minigun, just looks like that. We have horn minigun, which shoots the horns, even though they do still look like slingshots, actually. Also, the reason that these things are purple is because the menu is purple, and it just looks good. Yes. We have this, yes. and it does kind of look funny with the horn trail. We also have this one. Same as always there. We have cloud slingshot. It's the cloud ones. We have the spider bow. It's just a spider bow from the Halloween update. We have the snowball minigun, it shoots snowballs. We have the cupid arrow minigun, which uh, shoots the cupid arrows. We have the ice minigun, very cool. Elf bow minigun, it's these. Molten rock minigun, these, pretty cool stuff. We have the lava rock, one of my favorites because of the sound. We have the cane bucket gift minigun, which is, which is new for this update. So, yeah, very very cool, really really cool. As you can see, it's the candy canes that you shoot. We have the coal bucket gift, the coal from the bucket. I didn't even know you can get this because I haven't really played this update, but which is, but this is pretty cool. That's all in new. We have the roll. Yeah, so they are very loud, he says, so keep take that into consideration when you're using this around your friends and stuff. Um, then we have this one. We have the round one. I didn't even know these exist. That's really cool. We have the mm -hmm. square one. Then we have the audio index. He's going to explain what that does. So basically, when you turn it on, if you hold your right trigger, the number gets bigger and left trigger. So, like other menus, they just have like a set of um, ear rapes, and it's just like you can't really customize it. With this one, you can literally change the number, and depending on what number it is, it'll play a different audio. We have spanned index audio. <laughs> I don't know what that is. And that's just what plays the audio. Right, it's right grip and trigger. Oh, you, yeah, oh, right yeah, grip and trigger. We have break all audio, yeah. it breaks everyone's audio while you use it, so they'll, after that, they'll be able to hear, but when you use it, they won't be able to hear you. We have break audio gun, it's, it's a gun, you use it on one specific person, only they will be able to hear it. We have break all audio V2, which is just another sound, it's the crystal sound. Same with this, breaks his audio. We have projectile spammer. It is undetected and working. We have ropes up here. You use right trigger, the ropes go up. We have ropes down, the ropes go down. We have freeze rope. Uh, it freezes in place, but it still does move a bit. After well, that, we have- It lags uh, more than freezing them. Yeah, so it's more like a lag ropes. We have spaz ropes, spazzes them out. And we have ropes to self. When you use this, the ropes come to you. This is how it looks for them. It's pretty weird for them. It just flew off. We have the report gun. You can report somebody, but I'm not gonna do it even though reports don't go through. Then we have head spin here. We have head spin. Your head spins like this. We have upside down head. Your head is upside down. Then we have rotate head to nearest player. So it's going to rotate your head to the player that is closest to you, as you guys can see. Then we have spaz monkey. I'm gonna look like this, pretty weird. But it's cool for ghost trolling. We have anti-crash. What this does, you won't be able to see projectiles. So I'm gonna turn it on, just in case there's more projectiles. We have water splash shelf. That counts as a projectile, but basically, you don't have to press any buttons. Yes, you don't have to press any buttons. Then we have 60 hertz. Uh, if you, you have, you just get 60 hertz.
on your um, headset, which is like one of the best hurts for wall running, I think. We have water balloon yeah. projectile fountain. What this does, I think it comes out of your head. Yeah, it comes out of your head. And just look at that. It is just a lot of water balloons, basically. Then we have water balloon projectile rain, which means um, it's just gonna rain from the sky, basically. And it's not coming out of my head, as you guys can see. Okay, then we have anti-report. If somebody gets too close, if somebody gets close to the yeah, uh, leaderboard, yeah, demonstrate it. Yeah, but I, I do have it turned Wait, off. But basically, it's not working. Wait, what the? No, I turned oh, it off. I turned it. it off. Oh, wait. Let me turn it on. You can use it on me. Okay, so you guys will see um, when I when someone gets too close to the report yeah, button for yeah, them, get near the they button. they automatically get disconnected. You see, if I get too close, they get disconnected. We have anti-report distance. Uh, you use your triggers to uh, change it. Basically, what this does, it's how close somebody gets to it, to your report button. So if it's lower, they can get closer to it, like yeah. when they're trying to mute you or something. Yeah, I turned we it have off. anti anti-report anti v2. v2. Yo, um, I think it's. I don't know if it works, but it should like directly cancel the report. It might not work, but. Yeah, just use it just in case, it's because it's not detected. Yeah, so it's not detected, it might not be working, but um, it cancels the report, but I don't really use things like that because reports sometimes go through. Anti-mod checker, mod checkers do not work on you, so that's pretty self-explanatory. We have no controller vibrations, You don't. your controller doesn't have vibrations. We have server-sided menu click sound, so basically everyone will be yeah, able to hear. hear Everyone will be able to hear I when I click on. something. See guys, you can hear it. We have first person camera. Basically, usually... It kind of breaks it. It breaks your camera mod kind, I think. Yeah, so basically, usually, when you don't have a camera mod, it's going to look something like this. But if you use first person camera, it's going to look like this, basically. But uh, I'm not going to use it because of my camera mod, obviously. We have destroy senses gun. It destroys their oh, yeah. senses. So basically, they can't see or hear anything. We have mod checker troll. No, so basically, explain. um, if they um try to mod check you, all of your files is just gonna be a thinking emoji. It's just going to be in all your files are going to be changed into an emoji, like the thinking emoji. It's yeah. on screen right now. Yeah, we have balloon a... shotgun. No. It just it spreads a lot, like like a shotgun usually does. That's how it looks. Pretty chaotic. It might lag a few people if you shoot it yeah, up it in does. the if, sky. Uh, if you um, this is like a lag. All you can do, you can um, fly out of the map and just put the speed to slow, put the projectile trail to whatever you want it to be. And if you just shoot into the void long enough, everyone will start lagging. You have candy cane spammer. It spams candy canes, which is really cool. I didn't know. I didn't know about all of these projectiles in the new update. But it's pretty cool. And that is that. Okay guys, so you have the video. That is the Rexon mod menu. It is free. The creator was with me the whole time. He helped me with this. And if you want to get the menu, like I said, it is in the description below. It's in the disc it's in his Discord and my Discord, which is both linked in the description below. So if you want to go get it, it's right there. And if you don't know how to get it, the video would be right here. On how to get it, it should be right here. Here. Right here. Thank you guys so much for watching the video and subscribe because it's very cool. Oh.